In a message from the George Washington University president, Thomas LeBlanc, he addressed mandatory diversity training for all incoming students and Greek Life members, among other steps the university will take in response to the offensive media post. The president plans to update the student code of conduct and establish a Race in America speaker series on this important issue. The minority students at the George Washington University are coming together in a fight for equality. Organizing town hall meetings in George Washington's very own Imani Ross, Jr., political science major, proposed the Alpha Phi Bigotry Act in a stand against the racist video created by members of the sorority. So, Last couple weeks ago, we had an incident similar to AU where a student posted a photo. So the Alpha Phi, it's called the Alpha Phi Bigotry Act. Mm -hmm. It was a response to that particular incident, yeah. but also a call to action to improve in inclusion, inclusivity practices on campus. So the Alpha Phi Bigotry Act came about after the racially insensitive post that arrived. I remember Alfie Sorority posing with a banana um, and stated that she was 116 black. Some of the main things that I focus on, um, making sure that our next dean of students is a person of color, preferably a black person. Somebody with a long history of um, fighting and advocating for inclusivity and diversity. It calls for the removal of Alpha Phi, which is bigger than just the incident, but it's more to do with the culture that they create and the students' voices were able to be heard. Even if they don't care, they're heard, you know? And that's always, I think that's always a positive. So. For Howard University's News Vision, I'm Kenae Damon.